Hello, I'm Andy and I'm going to read to you a weekly horoscope from November the 12th up to November the 18th and this is for you coming from Virgo. Let's start with November the 12th. It starts very nicely for you and it brings plenty of promise that good things are going to happen for you whether you are with your loved ones or whether you are going to be out with your business people or with your colleagues or bosses. So these are some of our good business planets as well. So mix business and pleasure on this Sunday of morning, afternoon, evening period and you'll be able to do well. There's one planet who's floating around. This is the planet who brings troubles in relationships or partnerships. So tell yourself not to be, for you coming from Virgo, not to be argumentative, not to be dominating and try not to bring up issues that bring bad news basically that if you can control this, you will have a pretty good morning, afternoon, early evening period. The evening nightfall period, you have to be very careful. This nasty planet becomes very stable, doesn't want to leave, brings opposition, makes you confrontative, makes you provocative, can bring bad news about a romance or marriage, and whoever you are with, arguments can erupt. So you see, so many things can go wrong. I've made you aware. So try to stay away from people who create trouble. Try to be with people you can get benefit from. Try to be your best in behavior. And you can do a turnaround and make your evening and nightfall session better and better. Let's go to the November the 13th and it starts very well for you. These are very quick term planets, very fast planets and they bring opportunities very quickly on the morning, afternoon and early evening period of November the 13th. It's a working day, you will be at work or you will be in business. So be on your toes. You've got to reply emails, reply your faxes, re re reply phone calls and you will see that you can get a lot done and get done very quickly and unexpectedly as well in the morning, afternoon and early evening periods. Now, I don't like your evening and nightfall period at all. In fact, one of these planets which I don't like for you is also active in the morning, afternoon and early evening period. And this planet can bring a lot of problems. If you are traveling around, can bring accidents. It can create hidden enemies, meaning that you are saying or doing things people don't like and they are not going to show it at your face, but they'll stab you in the back when they get the opportunities. So many things can go wrong, especially in the evening and nightfall period, whoever you are with. If you don't need to socialize, just go back to your own home because you can have accidents, you can drink too much, you can be in the company of people who are not good. All these things can just turn the evening nightfall session very bad for you. Be very aware. November the 14th starts very well for you and going to end very well for you. You are going to be lucky. Many possibilities are there at your place of work, in your business area, you're going to get very good news and whatever you do, you're going to do very well. So focus on what's important. Get things down on what can impress the people you want to impress. And you will see that good news comes in your place of work. Good news comes in business as well. You're going to be extremely lucky if you're chasing for romance, a new romance during this day of the 14th of November. So go all out and try it. And you're going to make some good partnership deals as well if you're in business. Evening nightfall period remains also very good. And so now long-term planets are being very steady. They are creating a long-term bonding, whether for business, whether in your workplace, whether in romance, whether in your marriage. So it's a very good evening and nightfall session too. Be out looking your best. November the 15th, Wednesday starts very poorly for you. The news coming is very bad at your place of work. News coming in your business area is also not steady. By the time you leave home, you're already in a state of mind which something has made you unhappy. Drive carefully, accidents are possible. Emotional accidents, verbal accidents, physical accidents are all waiting to happen. So I've made you aware of it and if you are very careful, you will slowly confuse these planets of negativity. They will slowly melt and they will subside and you will be slowly controlling them. Evening nightfall period, the planet of 
aggression moves in. This planet is not your enemy. But because there is earlier part already a negative planet who also moves in in the evening nightfall period, now with the aggressive planet, you can see that aggressiveness is the negative type of aggressiveness. You are like a bull in a china shop, just doing this and that and wrecking all the good possibilities you have. You can be confrontative, you can be provocative. So don't do all that and you will tame these planets and even make your evening nightfall session good enough. Your November the 16th, Thursday morning, afternoon, early evening period, very bad. And so they bring bad news at your place of work, bad news in business. Even before you leave home, there's already stress created. And so you are under pressure emotionally, you are under pressure work-wise or business-wise. Things can go wrong in any, any de department of your life. Be aware that you can control this by not creating enemies. So be careful what you say, be careful what you do and how you do it. That way you can be attracting support because you will slowly tame these negative planets and they will slowly leave you alone because they can't do much. They will melt down. And that way you can improve your morning, afternoon and early evening period. The evening itself and the nightfall period, the planet of ego moves in and not very favorable to you. So you're going to be aggressive in the way of easily uh, not happy with anybody criticizing you. You could behave arrogant. You could behave in a critical manner, meaning, meaning criticizing people. And doing this, of course, your morning, afternoon and early evening period and also nightfall period become worse and worse and worse. You are being watched, so you've got to be on your best behavior. You might meet important people, so you've got to say things carefully and do things carefully. Otherwise, don't socialize in the evening nightfall period. Go back to the safety of your own home. Be by yourself. November 17 starts very well for you long-term and very steady planets are there. They help you in your place of work, they help you in business, they help you in marriage, they help you secure a new, con new uh, romance or improve your romance as well. These are slow planets, so be patient with them. Hour by hour, they build up the good news for you. Hour by hour, they create the atmosphere which is others want to help you. Evening nightfall period, emotional planets move in. Now, that's not bad. But I call them water planets. They make you moody, they make you oversensitive, they make you very changeable, changing plans. Could be plans are changing, so you have to make plans. So be prepared for the evening nightfall period that all this can happen. This planet is also there in the morning afternoon period and could do little bits of problems like these that I've described to you. Let's move to November the 18th which is a Saturday. If you are at work, take the soft approach. If you are doing business, take the soft approach. Very important. Whoever you are with, you have to take the soft approach. That simply means use words which are soft, a tone of voice which is soft, a body language that is soft, soften the atmosphere. And whoever wants to be arrogant, whoever wants to be aggressive with you will go soft as well. That's the trick. That's how you melt down these planets of aggression. If you feed them, then you will appear aggressive and you will, your tongue gets very aggressive as well. So you can turn this morning, afternoon and early evening period to your favor by taking the soft approach. The evening and nightfall period, good planets are there waiting to welcome you. And, but if you spoil the earlier part of the day, a lot of repair will have to be done. So don't do too much damage earlier part of the day and evening nightfall period are very enjoyable. Mix business and pleasure. Be out with the people you work with or people you do business with. Have them mix up with your people you love as well and will be a very enjoyable evening nightfall period. Only one thing I ask of you, don't be dominating. Because this is a planet who can make you behave dominatingly, that you want control, you want to have the last say, people must do as you say. Don't want to do that and you'll enjoy your evening nightfall session very much. Well, that's the week that was and now I'm already Skyping and I'm charging USD 50.50 for a 90-minute Skype session with me. That will have to do for your next five or six years in all areas of your life. 
let me help you make your next five or six years as perfect as possible in all areas of your life, as lucky as possible. And I will need your date of birth, I will need your time of birth, and I will be looking at your palms while we Skype. In fact, I will ask you to photo your palms and send them before because they are much clearer and sharper when you send them by email. And I will look, face read you as well. And I will even use Kabbalistic Tarot if you want. Give me the chance to make your next five or six years as best as possible. And so go to Skype, go to Facebook, send me a message, send me an email and let's get down to it and get your next five or six years fully under your control. Until then, thank you and good luck.